With pollen counts high and mountain cedar back in the air, you might be having asthma issues. But coughing, shortness of breath, and wheezing could signal other diseases too. In particular, there's symptoms of COPD, or chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, and asthma. Ursula Perry shows you how to tell which one you might have. There are nearly 24 million adults living with COPD, while 25 million are affected by asthma. The symptoms might seem identical, so how do you tell which one you have? One difference is that asthma can start at any age, but COPD does not occur in people until they're over the age of 40. So even if you've never had asthma growing up. The fact is that we don't know why some people have it as adults. We don't know what factors the, of the environment that interact with this genetic predisposition. Also, COPD is mainly triggered by cigarette smoke, first or second hand. But asthma has many triggers, such as mold, dust, pollen, or pet dander. Your breathing changes in asthma, but with the help of your inhaler, it can go back to normal. In COPD patients, it never gets better. There's no cure for asthma, but it, it can be controlled easily. And, um, you don't have the deterioration of the lungs like you do with COPD. COPD is, like I said, it's progressive, and you have that deterioration of lung function over time. Ursula Perry, KSAT 12 News.